same people back with a bang. This is the Money Management. It's Financial Friday. So let's talk money. Let's talk online money. Let's talk hustle. Give $1 million to a self-made millionaire, they'll turn into $10 million. Give $1 million to someone who's broke and they'll spend that money in no time. Money is not the issue. It's about knowing the rules of money, managing risk, hustle, curiosity, work ethic, being smart. A lot of people always say, if I had a million dollars, I'd do this. If I had a million dollars, I'd do that. I'd be so much better off with a million dollars. Now, yes you would, but for a short period of time. Why? Because within no time, if you're a broke person, if you've got a broke mentality, a broke mindset, you'll spend that money like this. A millionaire, however, what will they do with the money? They know how to manage risk. They know how to use it to their advantage. They know how to use that money to work for them. Many millionaires, you know, become millionaires because of their ability to manage risk, their work ethic, their humility, their curiosity with money. Everyone always says, oh, the rich keep getting richer. Yes, they do. Why? Because you can give a million dollars to a rich person and they'll make $10 million from it. You can give that same million dollars to someone who's broke and they'll waste it all. They'll spend it so quickly. Imagine making money online. Let's say $20 profit per sale. One sale a day, $600 per month. Five sales a day, $3,000 per month. 10 sales per day, $6,000 per month. Now I know that's not easy, but your nine to five is not easy either. Money's everywhere. You just have to learn to hustle for it. You just have to learn how to use it. You just have to learn how to put it to your benefit. Everybody has difficulties in their life. Whether you're a millionaire, whether you're broke, whether you want to make money online, whether you hate making money online, you want to work for your money, whether you exchange time for money, whether you use your money to make money. None of that is easy. So why not do what's most beneficial? Here's something that's most beneficial. Let's say you spend, I don't know, two weeks writing an ebook. That ebook is 100 pages long. It took you ages, you know, but it's a great ebook and it's about something you've done. Let's say plumbing. Now you've written that ebook. Now you can go and sell it to people who want to be plumbers worldwide. And let's say you sell it for $20, like I said. Then, you know, let's say you make five sales in a week. You just made $100. You're better off by $100 now. Let's say you do make, you know, thousands and thousands from that ebook. Well, guess what? You don't stop there. Now you use that money to go invest in creating a video guide. You know, you invest in advertising. You invest in, you know, making your money work for you. You use your money that you've made from the ebook and you start to grow. Now, none of that is easy. Maybe, you know, those two weeks to write that ebook were grueling. Perhaps. I mean, you know, I understand. I've written ebooks. I understand how it works. But once you've written it, once you've created it, you're done. It's there for life. You might make some tweaks here and there, but you're set. From now on, however much you sell it for, you're making profit. Even if you decide to sell it for five bucks, you're making profit. That's how people make money online. You have to have the hustle. You have to know how to, you know, earn your money. Now, with that, there's not really that much risk because if no one buys it, then it's fine. You didn't really lose any money. You lost a couple weeks, but you didn't really lose any money. When it comes to, let's say, something like investing or, you know, real estate or even starting an online business, I find that a lot of people struggle because they don't have money and they dive straight into online business or they dive straight into, you know, real estate or something like that. Why not first... Find out something you can actually, you know, build from the ground up. It doesn't take a lot of money. Maybe even if you need a nine to five to create the means for it, you need to do that. But the reason I'm talking about making money online today is because it is pretty simple. It's not easy, but it is simple. You find something where you can get something like $20 profit per sale. You make 10 sales in a week, you come out with $200 profit. You find something which you can, you know, help people learn with, you can teach people with, you can change people's lives with. It's going to benefit you in the long run. It's going to be benefit them in the long run. So, whether that be smartwatches, selling iPhones, selling camera stands, selling, you know, anything. You find something that makes you some profit, you start slowly and you gradually build up. When you're starting to get that money, use it for advertising. Use it for, you know, buying more inventory. You, you use it for, you know, buying new products. You use it for expanding your business. If you get to the point where you're making thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars, Guess what? You can now branch into another area. You can use it to fund your real estate. You can use it to start a clothing brand. You can use it to do so many different things. But this is why the rich get richer, because they do these kind of things. The poor people, they'll, you know, maybe get a pay rise or they'll come up with some money from somewhere or they've been given some money, they've earned it, whatever. They use it to buy 
nice designer clothes. They use it to buy you know, a new phone. They use it to buy a nice car. They use it to put a down payment on a house. Their money isn't working for them. They're using their money to spend. And that's why they become broke like this. That's why I said, you give $1 million to a rich person or a self-made millionaire, they're gonna make $10 million from that. You give $1 million to a broke person, you're gonna come out with zero. So I hope you guys understand the message of today. It's a pretty simple video. It's not a difficult concept to grasp. But of course, you know, not everybody understands it. You guys are here watching this video because you understand it. So well done for that. Use your money to make you money. Don't always exchange time for money. And trust me, you're gonna be better off in the long run. We've all got skills, we've all got knowledge. We all know we've got the tools online. Google, YouTube, social media, it's all out there. So, that's it for today's video, guys. Tomorrow's the weekend. What are you doing to better your life? The weekend is where winners are made. The weekend is where empires are built. How are you gonna spend this weekend? Don't say you don't have the time, because it's the weekend now. You do have the time. Anyway, that's it for today's video, guys. Keep liking, subscribing, sharing, commenting, all the good stuff. Thanks a lot for watching. Make sure you guys are back here tomorrow for the weekend. I've got money to making. You've got money to making. See you guys tomorrow for another video. Peace.